being positive, it's just all kind of just being delusional. Hey guys, welcome to welcome back to my channel. I am currently in the Dollar General parking lot because I had to buy packing tape because somebody bought like all of my items off of Depop. So I'm going to post a lot more when I get home. So here's my, my, my Depop handle. But in today's video, it is March 29th, I think, and it is about to be April. So I thought we could do like an April monthly reset type of thing because I just thought it would be fun to do. Today is such a beautiful day outside. Like it's so sunny and it just feels so summery right now. And like, ugh, I love, love spring, spring because all of the flowers and stuff are blooming, but I'm gonna prepare for April, April showers, and spring break starts April 5th for me, and I have prom April 5th and stuff like that, so I'm really excited. Before we even start anything, I want to say thank you so much for a thousand subscribers. The morning I hit a thousand subscribers, I checked my phone, and we had just hit 950 subscribers, and I was like, oh, maybe in a few days we'll hit a thousand, because I typically don't gain that many subscribers. But I was in class like five hours after I checked it in the morning and I checked it and I turned to my friend and I'm like, I'm two subscribers away from a thousand and I ended up hitting it like a minute later. We are currently at a thousand a hundred and sixty six subscribers. Every time I reload my page, my subscriber count goes up. It is actually crazy the amount of support that I've gotten. Like I just read through the comments and I'm like smiling <laughs> because thank you. I guys i can't even say much more it makes me so happy that you guys like enjoy my content so thank you i love you guys anyways i'm gonna drive home it is such a beautiful day and i'll see you guys when i get home okay welcome back <laughs> One of the first things I'm going to do is I have this dry erase like calendar thing up on my wall like right above my desk so I see this every day. It's really easy to see like dates and special events and just any stuff I've planned throughout the month. Right now it's on March so of course we're going to change it to April because April is going to be a very busy month for me so I need to go ahead and start to like see and plan how my month is going to go because <laughs> a lot is gonna be happening this month. I would totally recommend that y'all like get a dry erase calendar thing or like a paper calendar to hang up on your wall. And if you already have one, then follow along with me and reset our calendar together because I, I mean, it's the most important part of resetting for a month you know, see the stuff that you're gonna do for the month and be prepared for it. So let's jump straight in to just preparing our calendar. <laughs> Okay, here's my calendar. Um, here's a little like header I put for the month and so far on my calendar I don't have a lot of stuff because I only checked um, my study schedule calendar and My work schedule and I just threw in some stuff that I know is happening. I haven't like completed it yet though But I basically got most of it done. The second thing we are going to do together I'm actually super excited about because I love doing this every month but basically every month I make a vision board of all the stuff that um, I want to visualize and happen for the month. Doing this also makes it easier for me to like be able to complete my New Year's resolution goals. So I really like doing this. How I do this is I go on Pinterest and I just save a bunch of pictures and of stuff and quotes and just stuff that revolves around the stuff that I want to do for the month. So in, in this case, April. And I always have a header that says the month's date. Like my favorite headers are the ones that say like April chapter four of 12. So yeah, and then I 
open up a thing on Canva and I tap create new design or whatever and I type in desktop wallpaper and then that's the size that I choose and I just drag everything on there, mix it all around and then I just put it all on a thing, save it and then put it as my desktop wallpaper which is pretty simple, quick and easy but it's so much fun to do. This is my April one. I'm so proud of it. My goals for April um, are a lot of studying because it's the month before AP exams. So I'm just going to grind out studying, doing stuff for AP art, and, and, and trying to make sure that I put my grades top priority. My next stuff is just to do a lot of self-care this month because it's AP exam season. I'm going to do some self-care. Um, I'm planning on buying some new clothes and changing up my room aesthetic and my clothes and stuff like that because I just sold like all my clothes on Depop, which is crazy, but I'm trying to just take an easy, nice, slow month. And I, I, I put some cool quotes on here. Like I put a quote that says, reset, realign, restart, reclaim, reignite, which I thought that was like... That's what I'm trying to do this month. And I have a quote that says, the best is yet to come. And I have a quote that says, God's plan over my plan. So I really love this. It looks so cute. I'm gonna take this and take all the pictures and then remake a smaller one for my phone. I'll show you guys. For my phone's wallpaper, I do this Pinterest board um, template from Canva. So it only has a few pictures. So I, I I basically just have to choose like my top priorities this month so I'm gonna go ahead and do that and here's my phone screen before okay here's my new phone screen yeah it just has a few of my favorite pictures from the main one so yeah <laughs> but that's basically all the vision board type thing stuff that I have done i will see you guys when i do something new because i have to get ready for work and stuff like that so see you soon It's been like two weeks. I have bangs now, by the way. My bangs don't look the best today because I kind of made my hair flat, which it makes my head look weird. But hey guys, it's been almost three weeks. <laughs> um, I, I just wanted to talk to you guys and, and tell you guys what happened because a bunch of stuff happened over the past few weeks. The main thing that happened and the main reason why I couldn't vlog this is that I'm single now. Like, I, I think back in October or something, I made a video called Heartbreak. The thing about being positive is it's all kind of just being delusional. Like, seeing the brighter sides of things is sometimes just being absolutely delusional about something. And that's how I was with my relationship with this person, is I was just, like, ignoring all the bad stuff that he did and the toxicity of it all to kind of just be delusional and be like guys it's a good relationship <laughs> comment down below the rainbow emoji if you guys stayed till this far because you know it's like april showers bring flowers or whatever is that the quote 
I'll see you guys next week. I love you guys so much and thank you for the support. And I'm sorry for this being such a weird video. Um, but I, I adore you guys, so. Bye. Also, also, before I leave completely, thank you for all the people who joined my lives. That was so much fun to like live action talk to you guys and hear response and feedback immediately. That was so amazing. Anyways, bye.